first thing you should do before upgrading MB uh, from 4880 to 4890, or pretty much any update, is to ensure you're backing up your server. To do that, you should have the Backup and Restore plugin installed and configured correctly, especially going out to your backup folder. Once you've done that, you want to head over to Scheduled Tasks, and then click on the MB Server Backup option at which point it'll start the backup process. Once the backup process is complete, which it has now completed, we can begin. First thing we're gonna to wanna to do is go to the dashboard and shut down the server. Because if you notice at the top, it says, please shut down MB server and install the latest version. So we're going to shut the server down Give it a few seconds and attempt to refresh the page, at which point it should give us our bad gateway error or something similar, depending on your reverse proxy. After we've shut down the server, we can go to uh, the MB downloads page, find the file we want to download. In this case, it's the MB hyphen server hyphen deb 4890 package. This is for the x64 system. If you've got another, you'll use the other versions, right click, Copy link address, use wget, and we're already in the downloads folder where we want to go. But you can specify any folder you want. That'll download the file. We've shut the MB server down so we can proceed to the second command. Don't forget you need your pseudo privileges. And the upgrade should now be complete. We head back to our website page and refresh. Should now be running 4890. Don't forget to check out my channel videos on KL Tech videos on YouTube. I've got a host of home lab and technological videos that I'm sure will be of interest to you and your friends and family. And as always, thank you for watching.